Hare Shalom. I want to start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim Yahushai, Ba'ashim Harakakadash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace and salutations to the hopefully elect. And I'm just doing this lesson through the spirit and power of Yahweh, Ba'ashim Yahushai. Um, I just got off work, you know, not too long ago. Um, and uh, I was actually falling asleep, you know, and uh, I just had this quick vision, man. And um, I'm trying to explain it to the best of my ability. So uh, um, it was just like I was in like a like a, a parking lot type of setting. You know, there was other people around, people that I knew, you know, uh, and just other people uh, in the surroundings. And, um, you know, it just started to like thunderstorm. But this thunderstorm was like, the loudest thunderstorm I ever heard in my life, you know, and it was kind of frightening, you know, you just just hear it real loud, and it was like, but it was it was loud to the point where it was like, oh, this is it, you know, that's that's what I was saying in the back of my mind, you know, as I'm around, like this is it, and it was so loud, and uh, it was so. You know, this vision was so vivid, like, it shook the earth, man, on how loud this, these uh, thunderstorms were, man. You know, it wasn't even a thunderstorm, but it was like a, uh, you know, uh, like the boom the thunderstorm brings, you know, uh, without the lightning. It was like, this, you could hear the sound, but it was without the lightning, and it was just real loud, and it went, it got louder and louder and louder, you know, you know, but then the earth started to shake, you know, and, um, I just knew I'm like, this is it, this is it, this is, we're at, this is it, it's over, you know, and then you heard this, this long, this, uh, loud siren, you know, like if you ever heard of a, uh, a, a, like a jail siren, you know, when it's time for them, everyone to, uh, close your doors and things like that. It sounded like that, like real loud, like burn, and like, but it was loud, you know. And uh, you know, people around me was just frightened, you know. I, I was a little frightened, so to speak, you know. Um, you know, uh, yeah, like, it was just this loud noise, you know, like you just, like, oh man, um. You know, but yeah, the ground started to shake and then, you know, it's just like the clouds just cracked open, bro. And he's just, these vehicles, the chariots start coming out. Like when they first start coming, I'm thinking it was like, you know, meteorites or something like coming through, coming, you know, to the earth. But it wasn't because you could tell because it was like flashing lights all around, you know. And then all of a sudden, like, you know, all I know is I was like flying in the air, you know, like not flying, but like, like beamed up, but just um, not like being raised up, you know, but that's, you know, what being, being beamed up in the scriptures, man. And while this was going on, you know, before all this, while I was going on, take a few steps back, um, I thought something was coming to a certain uh, area a little bit. So I tried to, you know, uh, walk off to the side and move from it, you know. But there was no escaping it, you know. However it may be, there was just no escaping it. And all I all I said was, uh, hey, I had to start praising, uh, praying to the Lord, man. You know, and I was just like, this is it. I was like, it's over. And I was just like, call Allah on. Yahweh Bashim Yahushah Bashim Habakadash Barakatam. And I was saying that even while I was in mid air, I was still saying it, man. Just, you know, praising Yahweh Bashim Yahushah. Just continue to say, call Halayon Wahwa Yahweh Bashim Yahushah. And I just kept repeating it, you know. And uh, and then it just, uh, I woke up. Like, that's how quick it was. But it was vivid it was loud it was like i was right there i mean i felt the ground shake i felt me in the air I, it man man oh man 
you know, and I thought I'd share this with you brothers, man, you know, uh, Lord willing, it may be a faith booster, man, but it's, oh, man, it's unexplainable, you know, but, and, you know, maybe this is why the Lord had me uh, stay home, you know, because I was going to run out, you know, go to the meat market and, you know, go get an oil change and things like that, and I was just like, you know what, nah, I'm just going to chill. And then, you know, I start falling asleep and then all of a sudden, boom, you know, I just got this quick vision, man, you know. Uh, but, yeah, man, we at the end of this thing, man. You know, it's coming very soon. You know, we just, I just pray to be a part of the elect. I pray to be beamed up and to escape this oncoming destruction that's coming to America, Babylon the Great. But I want to close out. I want to read the scripture. I want to uh Start at Revelation, the 18th chapter, the fourth verse, it says, And I heard another voice from heaven saying, Come out of her, my people, that ye may be not partakers of her sins, and that ye receive not of her plagues. You see, and this is talking about being beamed up. Okay? It's talking about being beamed up by the chariots when it says, Come out of her, my people. That what? That ye be not partakers of her sins. And that you receive not of her plagues, because what's coming to America, Babylon the Great, is destruction, man. Okay? Destruction from the thermonuclear missiles that's going to be shot off from the other nations via World War Three. Okay? This whole world is about to uh, fill it, you know, the judgment of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. Okay? Um... Who um let's get uh First Thessalonians four verse seventeen and it says I'll start verse sixteen it says For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout with the voice of the archangel and with the trump of the mo of the most high and the dead and the Mashiach shall rise first then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds, the chariots, right? The chariots of the Lord, the chariots of our salvation to meet the Lord in the air. And so shall we ever be with the Lord. We'll for comfort one another with these words, man. You see, and this is very comforting to know that we have a chance, man. Okay, we have a chance to escape the oncoming destruction that's coming upon this world, man. You see, we have a chance, man. So, you know, you brothers out there, let's keep fighting, man. You know, you, uh, you know, you sisters out there that's uh, sticking by, you know, your man's sad or, you know, even if you don't have it, man, you're doing what you got to do. You know, hey, keep fighting, man. You know, uh, even you, you young ones, you young children that may uh, watch the videos, okay, and you believe through the word that, uh, or, the men of the Lord, the servants of the prophets that are preaching and teaching in all truth, faith, faith and sincerity, you know, hey, pray that you continue to be a believer, man, you know, and pray that, you know, you may be of the hopeful elect to get up out of here because we don't want to get the judgment of your house by Shimei Oshai. We don't be the one. We don't want to partake of the judgment of your house by Shimei Oshai, you know, and, uh, you know, I'm just, uh. You know, doing this lesson, you know, hopefully be a faith faith booster. You know, and uh hey man, this 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 thing is uh, uh it's about to be over, man. You know, our, our fight is almost over, brothers and sisters. You know, but I just thought I'd just share this to the spirit, you know, as it just uh it just, you know, it just took place about three minutes ago and I'm like, man, I gotta do a lesson, man. And then it shook me up right out of my sleep. You know, while I was in mid air and you know things that were still going on around me and I just woke up you know <clears throat> but you know um Lord willing I hope this a uh, quick lesson was out of five until next time I want to say shalom